Every four days, five brown bodies perish at our southern borders, attempting to cross over to the so-called land of opportunity. The children are being literally torn from the arms of their nursing mothers and being cast into cages. Women, before they are sent back, are being sterilized so they could no longer have children against their will or their consent. No matter how you want to look at this, we have a human crisis at our southern borders. And the question that many are asking is, why do they come? If, if these are the consequences of migration, why do they continue to come? My name is Miguel De La Torre. I'm the professor of social ethics at the Isla School of Theology. And, and join me as we begin to look at the political, the social, the economic uh, reasons why people risk their lives and the lives of their children in order to cross a border, regardless as to how high you want to build that wall. The course or the, the conversation we'll be having will attempt to wrestle with these issues from my own perspective. For I too was once what people like to call an illegal alien. And I stayed. And I want to share that process with you. I look forward to seeing you during the lecture.